Hi. Hi. Sorry, I'm late. No problem. How are you? Uh, I'm good. I want to ask you, you don't have to do it now. You can do it in your free time and tell me another day. But I want you to tell me what exactly poor means to you. And I'd like you to write a couple of sentences. Poor. Using poor. Yeah. Do you mean poverty? Yeah. Yeah. Because you always refer, I was thinking, you always refer to yourself as coming from a poor family. Oh. Uh, I, I don't know. Um, I, I cannot find appropriate adjective adjective uh, to describe my family. Maybe we can call it middle class. Yeah. Poor yeah. means uh, a regular family. What I mean? No, poor means really living in poverty. Your house is, if you have a house or you're renting one, it's really not nice at all. Uh, you go hungry some of the time. Your children aren't wearing nice clothes. You can't afford to send them to school. Can't afford to, to really live properly. I think my my parents, especially my father, they are mm -hmm. trying to save money. So mm -hmm. we are they're they're trying to save, you know, every single penny, you know, during okay. the for the past. Uh, 20 or 30 years. Okay. That is, uh, you know, some family would like to spend some money on their living conditions, but my parents don't. They never do that. Because there could be one or two reasons. They want to make sure that when they're old and can't work, that they have money to live on, sure. or they want to leave money to their children. Those are usually the two reasons people save their money. Uh, I, I I have no idea. Maybe they will not save money for their uh, the rest of their lives. And sometimes uh, they 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 would support me financially. They are sometimes sometimes they're very generous. Okay. Now I find it unusual, or maybe it's common in China. I don't know that you give your money to them that you earn. And then you have to go and ask them for money back and they decide whether or not you can have it. Is this what people do in China? Or is it just what you wanted to do? I think it's very common, especially when the kids are not married, you know. Okay. To give the money to their parents. But uh, it depends if the relationship or the bonds with the parents are not that close. The kids yes. won't give the money to their parents. They that will save sense. the money on their own account in the bank. Okay. okay. That makes sense. But, you know, you, so many times you, you have said to me, I'm from a poor family. And I was thinking yesterday, you're not from a poor family. You're not from a wealthy family, but oh. certainly not poor. There are two types of uh, families in China. Wealthy family and the poor family, in my opinion, and no in middle uh, in between. There is middle class. There, yeah. there is, there's definitely middle class. And I think your family fits into middle class because you've seen what poor people have or don't have. Mm -mm. So I would say your family is middle, is middle class. Oh yeah. But I've also seen wealthy families in in China. I mean, they'll call me from their homes and their homes are absolutely beautiful. Yeah. And I can see where they dressed and they tell me where they're going and you can definitely tell that oh, yeah. there's a lot of money in that family. So that's why I have difficulty understanding communism because <laughs> it's not the same for everyone. It's not. They just, it's the way they rule the government. But that's about it. 
I found out how somebody got from China got a green card in the United States. It's not easy. They would wait a long time, maybe 10 years. No, what they did is I spoke to this girl yesterday mm -hmm. and she tells me her family has green cards. I was surprised and because she's she's still in school. I said, how did you get green cards so fast? Her parents uh, invested in a business. Uh oh. Okay, and you have to invest a certain amount of money in a business. Oh, uh, that that would be a big sum of money. Oh, I'm sure. Yeah. I'm sure. Probably about half a million dollars. And they brought a they bought a house, but that has nothing to do with it because they just wanted to live there for a while. Mm. But they're an extremely wealthy family. I could see she was calling me from China. But seeing what the house looked like and what she way she was dressed, you'd like a girl like her, although you'd say she was too young. You know, I you know in China the the pretty girl from a wealthy family, they're they're looking down upon me, even though I like like them. I I think this girl looks down on a lot of people. Oh yeah, yeah, you you know that. Oh, I, I, I could, she was very nice, but the way she was talking, I was picking up from her attitude that she was a little condescending. Condescending. Yeah. Condescending means looking down on people or talking down to people. Yeah, I you don't like to, that. I you don't like to, No, nobody does. You wanted a big word. I gave you a big word. I know lots of big words. I just don't use them. Okay. I'll see you tomorrow. Have Thank you. Good luck in your exam. Thank you. Thank you. Good. Okay.